He'll send it back out to Page, open for three. That one spins out. Pinson, who just checked in, has the offensive rebound. Dishes it to James, who lays it up and in. 8-7 as Carolina doubles up Carter. Joel Berry gets the steal ahead to Pinson for the easy layup. Those were the two that had the double team and results in the easy two. All year, he had made 20 total, and he's already made two as the alley-oop is finished way up high by Bryce Johnson to tie the game at 11. And yet the game is tied because all these BC turnovers. Page has it left wing. Another three from him. This one's good. Second three of the day for Marcus Page. Long rebound to Bryce Johnson. He's going to run the break. Goes right side to Britt for an open three. Off the backboard, no, but there's Page swooping in to push it up and in with the offensive rebound. Well, you'd love to see Page seeing some baskets go in. Carolina up by five. Page, left corner to Pinson. Wide open lane to the hoop. He bounces it out to Barry, though, for three. Got it. Boy, Pinson was all alone down the baseline. Once somebody finally found him, he gave it to Barry, who drained it. The lids come off a little bit offensively now for the heel. Carter around a high screen, knocked away. Into James's hands, he'll give it to Pinson all alone for the two-handed plug. It was Pinson who tipped it away, so only fitting that Theo got the jam. Pinson tries the alley-oop to Johnson, has to come down with it, misses the layup, but Isaiah Hicks all alone for the offensive putback from the right side. Carolina goes a little cold. One of its last seven from the field after a stretch in which the Heels made 14 of 18 shots, but they still take an 11 point lead into the halftime locker room. They're a scrappy club, we knew that. Jimmy does a nice job with them and uh, we've got to play with more intensity ourselves. Carolina's done a nice job of flashing somebody into that to get an easy bucket. Joel Berry with the open court steal and he'll get the run out. Well, I'm not sure, we'll call it a lay dunk as he kind of pushed it over the side of the rim for two more. Just gets the rebound to Barry. Barry sprinting front court, goes coast to coast, off the window for two, and the foul. Boy, he was falling away to put that thing home. Back to Pinson. Boy, Williams now up off the bench, arms crossed. Down low, Bryce Johnson has it. Nice job with the strong hook shot from the right block off the glass. Pace of the game starting to pick up a little bit. It's 55-39. Pinson with the up and under on the other end. Anything you can do, I can do better. It has been just a very slumbering day here on a Saturday afternoon in the Smith Center. Page for three, left side. Good, maybe that'll wake him up. Well, that's Page's third of the day. Rebound knocks off the top of Britt's noggin, but he's able to find it. Pushes it ahead to Justin Jackson. Great pass, and it ends up in the two-handed jam for J Jackson in transition. Barry has it again, middle of the floor. Just 10 on the shot clock, looks in the middle of the BC zone, instead goes over to Jackson. He'll knife through the zone and hit the floater over Clifford. Eric, it's almost like that dunk has just brought Justin Jackson to life all of a sudden. Around that area to have a chance to do what it wanted to do this year as Britt with the crossover into the lane and lays it up. Another nice offensive move by Britt. Justin Coleman. Drives in, pulls up, and gets the jumper to crawl over the top of the rim. Justin Coleman with his first field goal of the season, and that's how this one will end. The Tar Heels get an 89-62 victory.